Hello everyone, welcome to some more NASCAR Heat 5. We are just two races, one race into the playoffs actually, and we have a solid uh, position, seven points up to be in the final four, but there's still plenty of races left before that championship race, and we're racing at the Fantec Fairgrounds, which I finished in 10th in last time, so not too good. So this could be a rough situation to knock us out of the playoffs, but I'm just going to have to try my best and see what I can do. See if we can advance with hopefully a win. Probably not this race, but we have a three-star truck offer right now, which isn't great, and we want to get a better one. So hopefully we can perform here. Well, we are off to a terrible start, starting in 21st. Remember, we are in a four-star car, so we're not supposed to win the championship. But I would just love to win it in this four-star car and get a five-star truck right through winning it. But we're just going to have to make the most of this race. I suck at this track. Just going to have to cut our losses and try to finish in a respectable position. Here we go. Oh, and at least we have someone in the back with us, Winger. Oh, and we already get whacked by another dirt semi-finalist. So they are getting their elbows out and being aggressive. Oh, it is three wide, nowhere to pass. We do make contact with the eight. And we are in last place now because we started on the high line. Tried not to be too aggressive. We don't want to make enemies. I'm going to try to slowly work my way through this pack, though. That was a rough, rough start. They were going three wide ahead of us. Couldn't make any moves. Come on. There are a couple playoff drivers ahead of us. We just want to be able to pass them. Let me pull up the relative on them. Where is it? There it is. Okay, no one near right now. They are all high up. That's not good. Let's slowly make our way through this field and see what we can do. Maybe around the outside. This is such a tough track. I am not good at these long dirt tracks. I do not know how to drive them. Overton sliding up gives us room to go under. Oh, yes, we got it. A little aggressive, but we got it. I'm just kind of tossing my car. And we are making some progress. Gonna have to go high, nowhere else to go. We do leave such a wide open window for someone to pass. Looks like he's going low on us. But we hold the position. I don't love the high line here, but there's not a lot of room. People are really blocking the bottom. There is a large chunk of people right here, though, that could help us make some passes. Come on, come on. Too much traffic. We just got to get our elbows out through this traffic. We're going to go low. Low line seems to be the move. But they're just blocking it. Come on. Okay, there we go. Finding some pace now. Finding some pace. Got contact on the inside. Weiss on us, but we hold him off. We're just going to have to be aggressive. That's the name of the game right here. Finally up to a playoff di driver. Broom Briggs up ahead. I want at least pass one playoff driver. He's right there. He has a good gap ahead of us, though. Come on. Oh, the car's so tight. The car is so tight. I've tried to lose this setup, too. Just really got to toss it. We're in no man's land once again. That keeps happening in these dirt races. We're halfway through the race, about to lap the last place guy, but... We've lost sight of Boom, unfortunately. 
We're kind of stuck here in 14th, last of the playoff drivers. But we'll just try to keep collecting as much points as we can. Oh, they're making contact up ahead. Maybe I could get saved by some aggressive driving by the drivers up ahead. Could help me catch up. I am slowly gaining, but not much laps left. I think about 10 laps to go. Oh, we got a guy inside. I didn't even notice. I think we're about to get lapped. Nine to go. And we are lapped. And we have a playoff driver in the lead, which means he's going to get a spot, unlike the last race where that one driver had like a 10 second lead on us. Maybe we should follow his line. Second place cars coming up ahead as well. Oh, and we make contact. We're three wide. People might be mad at me after this race. We get shoved all the way to the top by Pierce. He might be a little upset at us. Inside. And another car coming to make the pass. This is a rough race for our playoff contention. Two playoff drivers in first and in third. Not looking good. And we come to the line. Not a great finish for us. TJ Majors tells us he'll get us a better car, but I don't think this car will get any better by the time the playoffs ends. Let's see how that puts us in the playoff picture. Oh, we got a race earnings. Oh, and we are out of the final four right now. With still plenty of races for other guys to get a win, it is going to be a fight I will need to really perform in the next race. So let's just hop right into it. One point out of the playoffs, trying to beat Jimmy Owens. Welcome to Bristol. We are back at Bristol Dirt for the late model playoffs. And we have qualified in 15th, which isn't great, but I'm not great at qualifying. I'm actually pretty, feeling pretty good about this race. I think we can have a good finish. We need a good finish or we will be knocked out. Let's see what we can do. Here we go. Starting on the outside. Maybe that'll be good here, but I think I'd rather have the inside line. Oh, heavy contact. Davenport has a slowdown. We're going to get turned. We get turned. Have to shift into first. They don't throw the caution flag for us. And we are going to get completely passed. Oh my gosh, some dirty, dirty driving. Oh, I can't believe it. I guess as a rookie, they're all just hating on me. They're disrespecting me. And we're going to have to fight our way to get some spots. We need to at least pass Owens. Briggs, I don't think he's a playoff threat. He's always right in the back here. Oh my gosh, that's horrible. No caution too. I cannot believe that. Is this thing rigged against me? They don't want a rookie coming in and winning. They don't want me to get in a NASCAR. These old timers don't want me to move on. It's us against the world. Us against the world. Oh, I'm gonna hit the wall there. Oh, can we do a two for one pass? We're gonna send it. Fully a slide job on the inside. We do get a two for one pass. We're slowly making our way back to our qualifying spot. Everyone's driving so dirty and we get hit on the inside. Oh, he gets up on one leg. It makes me want to drive dirty on him. I was trying to keep it clean, make no enemies, but if everyone is just going to bully me out of the final four, well, I'm going to have to bully my way into the final four. Horrible, horrible sportsmanship by these guys. We're going to keep gliding on the inside. The inside pass seems to be the way to go. We're not even halfway done with the race, though, and we've already made it back to our qualifying spot, at least. 
Bristol Dirt Chaos. Oh, they make contact up ahead. Costner in the 32 allows us to make a move. So they're even racing dirty against each other. I guess elbows are just out here in these final races. Tensions are high between the drivers or something. Because everyone is getting their elbows out. I thought, what I've heard is that dirt racers are some of the most respectful. But in this game, that does not that is not representative. They are all fighting for their spots. We're about halfway through the race. We're going to need a miracle for something to gain some spots. But they are too wide up ahead, a lot of them. So we can get another two-for-one special on the pass. We got it. Nine's trying to go on our outside, but it's okay. We can hold it. We can hold it. Okay, okay. Let's push for a top ten. It's not over yet. Is that car smoking up ahead? Or is that just dirt? It's just dirt. I thought we were going to get a mechanical failure caution. That would have been huge. Boom Briggs up ahead. Briggs is actually our friend. So we have two playoff drivers up ahead. If we can make some moves on these guys, that will be massive. Gonna go underneath him, gonna be aggressive. We gotta be aggressive. I'm sorry, Scott. Maybe you weren't one of the mean ones, but it is what it is. I'm gonna do the same thing for Briggs, even though he likes us. But he might give us some room to pass, which would be nice. Come on. Oh, get on the dirt a little bit there. Got some lap traffic ahead. Lap traffic has caused us huge issues before, but not an issue this time. Oh, maybe a little bit of an issue. Briggs is getting away. I want a top 10. Come on. Still got a chance. Dawn is outside. No, he's coming in the middle. Oh, I should have just stuck it to the outside. Yikes. Let's try that again. It gives me room on the outside. Ay, yay yay! I can't control the car. My bad. He's going to be pissed. Ah, and lap traffic costing me a catch-up. I think we're about to get lapped. Who's this seven car? No, we're just getting past. We got to make a move on him. Can we do a switcheroo on him? Nope. Man, this is tough. Trying everything I can, but just not talented enough. But all we need is a win, so if I just have one good track, we can make the final four. Come on. Man, gonna have to settle for 12? That is not what I was looking for. <sighs> the lap traffic cost me one spot as well. And we got spin out. A rough, rough two races right here. We are. I think we're going to need to get a win. Unless a miracle happens, just like how we got into the playoffs. Barely squeezing our way in. We could squeeze into the final four. Wise makes some contact ahead, but that's not going to slow him down enough for us to make a move. I want to pass on the inside, please. Ah, ah, yeah, yeah. Finishing 12th, not great, not great at all. That is probably gonna knock us out of the playoffs. Let's go check it out. Whew. And we are out of the playoffs. They're three points out. Oh, slipping and slipping. Will we make the final four? Only time will tell. Keep on tuning in. But thanks for watching so far. See you next time.